So, und da sind wir wieder. Ähm, da ich ja nun die letzte Folge ziemlich krass überzogen habe. Und, Alter, was ist ziemlich krass, sind sieben Minuten halt, aber... Ja, ich war so drinnen mal wieder voll in dem Spiel, dass ich es einfach vergessen habe. So, wir haben nach... Ich möchte mal kurz was machen. Und zwar die Stimmlautstärke. Werde ich mal ein bisschen runterdrehen. So. Ich hoffe, das ist jetzt... Äh ähm. So. Falsch. Wo war's denn? Hier. Nachrichten. Unbekannte Nummer. Oh Gott, das ist der Nathan. Hundertprozentig. Halt deine große Klappe oder ich mach dich platt. Ich weiß, wo du schläfst. Ja, schön, dass du weißt, wo, du ich, wo ich schlafe. Und ich weiß, wo dein Haus wohnt, du Penner, Alter. So, Chloe. Äh. Max, Essen, to wait. Seh dich da. Brich dir beim Texten keine Finger. Hurra, Frühstück. Keine Emojis. Okay, keine Emojis. So. Oh shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. But it could be anybody. I better be doubly careful around here, or I could be in serious danger. Ja. If I'm not already. Ja. Äh, haben wir glaube ich schon. So. Hey Samuel, you're up early. Oh, hello young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. <clears throat> Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> What do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. Also der Typ äh, scheint gar nicht so doof zu sein, wie er aussieht. Weil der wird ja auch ein bisschen gemobbt, der läuft ja auch ein bisschen komisch so. Äh, leichte Behinderung wahrscheinlich äh, in den Beinen oder sowas. Keine Ahnung. Aber der scheint mir gar nicht so blöd zu sein, wie er äh, oder wie den die anderen eigentlich halten. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Can't Blackwell have at least one football zone? Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk for once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang out with Victoria? 
She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. <laughs> Not though. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Ach, fick dich. Hi, Taylor. Huh? I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. What what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. Ja, wunderbar. Da haben wir wieder was hinbekommen. Ach Mensch. Ja komm, Alter, fick dich. Max, get's over here. Warren. Warren, what are you doing here? Well, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. That was intense. Everything happened so fast. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. Weird fucking week. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Okay. Den Bus nehmen wir jetzt zum Two Wales. Mal sehen, was da so abgeht. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate or Rachel. Ja, an der Stelle läuft wahrscheinlich gerade wieder Musik, die ich aber nicht spielen kann, die ich nicht zeigen kann, oder, ja. Ich 
hoffe, die Busfahrt dauert nicht zu lange. Nicht, dass wir einpennen oder so. Krass, wie sie den Leuchtturm gerade im Hintergrund einfach mal in die Mitte oder ins, in den Mittelpunkt von der Szene gerückt haben. Der ist halt immer zu sehen irgendwie. Try to take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. I'm gonna be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exact. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. Nope, I don't want to go there. Haben wir schon wieder gehabt, ne? Das Loch in ein anderes Universum. That dirty RV from the other day. I oh, oh, stop that. Stop. stop. No barking. There was something creepy about that guy and his dog. Obviously nobody took my advice. Das ist tatsächlich derselbe Wohnwagen. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Hm. War jetzt nicht so interessant. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard it has. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. You did pretty good to have lasted this long. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay, if that tells you much. They own my school. Crooks gain respect when they put their names on schools and libraries. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. Ich 
So mich interessiert das, wie weit wir hier eigentlich jetzt äh, laufen können. Nope, I don't want to go there. Alles klar. Ah, guck mal, die läuft da. Die möchte ich hier mal verfolgen. Kann ich was mit der machen? Kann ich die schubsen? Oh, schubst die Alter einfach weg. Snow. Well, that's a good start to the story. Wetterdienste vom Schnee überrumpelt in einem seltenen Eigengeständnis hat der nationale Wetterdienst gestern zugegeben, dass es noch keine Erklärung für den ungewöhnlichen und kurzzeitigen Schneefall diese Woche in Arcadia Bay, Oregon gibt. Mhm. Excuse me, Sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire and our big headline is Snow. I can hardly wait for next week's big story. Clouds! The snow was pretty odd. It was right in the middle of a warm, sunny day. Oh, global warming bullshit. It's the Northwest. Snow happens. I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that or about missing girls. You mean Rachel Amber? Well, I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? Das ist so ein bisschen wie hier in Dommage. Wer will hier schon sein? <lacht> Excuse me. Könnt ihr mal googeln, wo das ist? Äh, Dommage. d o m i t z s c h Bei Torgau. <lacht> Alter, da gehst du krachen hier in dem Kaff. So. Aber das, ja. Wollt ihr wahrscheinlich gar nicht wissen. Da ist ein Penner. Da gehe ich hin. Kann ich ihnen Geld geben? Man sagt ja nicht Penner, man sagt ja, ähm, Homeless. Also, obdachlos. Hello. Oh, look at you. A fine example of youth. I bet you're a senior student. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. You must know Joyce Price from the Two Whales Diner. She's fed me more than my own family. Now's a daughter your age who's always in trouble. Married to a real prick. His name is David Madsen. He told me to get a job once, asshole. Not sure what Joyce sees in him, but he better treat her right. How long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? A thousand years. I've gone through the same changes as the town. What changes to the town? Once it takes a lifetime to see. There's a lot of beauty here, but a lot of darkness too. Greedy bastards that ruin this town put people out of work. Out of home. Like me. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. I bet you have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia Bay. Those days are dead, like anything in their way. I know somebody who's being threatened by a press card. Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family, especially not the law. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. Almost. I have to go now. Goodbye. Ja, die kennt sich hier ziemlich aus. Fand ich ganz gut, dass wir mit der geredet haben. So, mal sehen, wie weit wir hier noch kommen. Nope, I don't want to go there. Nö, da will ich nicht lang. Ja, okay, ist in Ordnung. Ich würde ja gerne mal auf die andere Seite gehen, da steht ein Polizeiwagen. Habe ich gerade gesehen. So, okay, gehen wir ins Diner. Äh, hier ist die Tür. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware makes me feel 13 again. 
Was ist so von beiden Seiten die Tür? So, mal gucken. Wir quatschen einfach mal jeden an. Er weiß, was bei rumkommt. Hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? Alter. Oh man, I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. That graffiti has been here forever. Thank you, redneck poet. Ich möchte mal kurz was gucken. Ja, das sind die Fotos, die wir gemacht haben. Gucke an. Ach hier unser Stingefinger. Ja, wir haben so viel. Guck mal, wir haben so viel nicht gemacht. So, warte mal hier. Rachel Amber. Dann ein kaputtes Skateboard hätten wir fotografieren können. Ein Spiegel hätten wir fotografieren können. Aha. aha. Ach, guck mal, wir können die Sonne fotografieren. Hier vor dem Ding, das machen wir gleich mal. Finde ich ganz interessant. Müssen wir uns gleich mal merken. 142, ein Knochen, einen angefressenen Donut. Okay. Gucken wir mal, ob wir das alles finden. So, warte mal, ich möchte noch mal kurz What rausgehen. Ich fühle mich wie Shit. Zu viel Bier. Also spare mich, bitte. Just let me suffer quietly. Okay, ich kann nicht raus. Hey, Trevor. Hallo, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You cracked me up, Maxer. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School. Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Ich sehe die gar nicht. Ich sehe die gar nicht. Leave me alone or I will vomit on you. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese.
So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard she even just got busted with pot in her room. Uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scanner. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell the loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching over. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. She can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joyce so much stress. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? He kind of has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Ja, den Frank haben wir ja schon kennengelernt. Oder seinem Hund haben wir kennengelernt. I don't feel like talking right now. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Over and out. Uh, hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. You sound like Joyce. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Joyce rules. I want to be exactly like her when I grow up. Looks like you're on your way. I've been coming to this dive for three years, and Joyce gives me shit like it's going out of style. That's how she rolls. That's why I worship her every move. Good. I can't wait to see you flipping greasy bacon in a diner when you grow up. Exactly like Joyce. Now pardon me while I get back to my coffee. Ach so ein Arsch. Ganz schön unhöflich, der Wichser. Naja. Ähm... Trotzdem müssen wir mal irgendwie... Achso. she is a lovely young woman how are you doing max hi joyce it's nice to see you again you look the same <laughs> like i'm still a waitress at two whales after all these years no like you still look pretty nice save kid you're still smart but i wish you'd been here to help save chloe she got busted yesterday smoking out again i know Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man, he just... Yeah, I'm sure he is since you married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. It's good you're here. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. 
I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why, I mean. Why? What did Chloe tell you? Sorry Leute, mir hat es gerade irgendwie, ähm, ist mein USB-Stick einfach ausgegangen, wo mein Mikrofon ranhängt. Äh, ich hoffe, das passt jetzt wieder. Also laufen tut es auf jeden Fall. Ich hoffe, das waren jetzt zu laute Störgeräusche dabei. Okay, ähm, machen wir mal weiter. Sorry auf jeden Fall. Ähm, ich muss glaube ich den USB-Stick mal ein bisschen abstützen, weil der hängt so ziemlich runter. Mal bitte gucken. Ähm, machen wir weiter. David hat sie geschlagen. Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful and he will be punished. But Chloe does put and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. That's no excuse to hit a girl. He's an adult. I don't like it, Max. David swore it would never happen again. He's true to his word. I just want us to be a family soon. I guess... I guess it's all about time. I right, Joyce. So, now let's get down to the nitty-gritty. What do you want to eat? Mm. Oh, I stay on bacon, Alter. But richtig, bacon is so geil, when it's richtig gemacht ist. I was dreaming of your bacon omelette. Now finish your coffee. <clears throat> One bacon omelet for the young lady, Stat. Nerd graffiti. Friend must. I love the delicious anticipation of breakfast. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the price. Boah, wow, nee, das geht's nur. Das ist halt ne. Karte. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep Can going I back in time. Before I die? This is a diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bank. This is like fourth dimension. Und ich habe schon wieder die Folge vergessen. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you'll love this. Drooling like a baby. Still can't believe woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ah. Oh. Mm, speak of the devil. Mom and Max together again. And Chloe look for a free meal. Put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat to you for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Unless you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh, God, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last? Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. What is it on the jukebox?
now that that's out of the way. Left about your superpower. I don't have any explanation, and I explain I saw a crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can win time. This is all happening so fast. Start here. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even see my pockets. See. Okay, Max. Impress me. You have a tube of glitter in there, right? Nada. Eh, wrong answer. Poke it, girl. Let me show you what's actually in the pocket. That we bundle. You even made me want to believe you. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. So, ein Schlüssel und ein Anhänger. Zigaretten, ein paar Pennies und ein Verwarnungsticket. Ähm, Franklin Street, Twin Peaks, 10.34 Uhr. Out of. Ach so, ein äh, Parkticket. Also. Achso, warte mal, wir können ja hier. Dies ist eine Verwartung, Ort so Franklin Street, Datum 21.09.2013, 10.34, Twin Peaks. Ihr Fahrzeug im Berggebiet geparkt, außerhalb des gekennzeichneten Parkbereichs. Sie stellen ein Hindernis für den Verkehr oder Fußgänger dar, parken Sie nicht wieder in diesem Bereich. So, das war's. So, let me tell you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Alter, ernsthaft? 13 cigarettes. I suck too much to have 13 cigarettes. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Alter, wir müssen uns das sehr genau angucken. Ich hätte jetzt gedacht, das reicht, wenn wir wissen. So, guck mal, sie hat. Was beyond epic fail. <lacht> ja, drei, äh, sechs Zigaretten drin. So, pass auf, wir gucken uns das jetzt nochmal genau an. Ähm, ansehen. Okay, Max. So, ein Schlüssel. Mit eine Panda oder sowas dran. So, dann. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 Zigaretten. Ähm. 1, 3, 4, 5, 6. Und vier Kors. Vier und sechs Cent. Und. Out of Parking Bay. Franklin Street. In also Das muss ich mir alles merken. 10.30 Uhr. Twin Peaks. 21.09.2013. 10 Uhr. 21.09.2013. 10.34 Uhr. So, okay. Kriegen wir hin. So, this is me telling you what. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Zigaretten. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many? Cigarettes? Seven cigarettes. A super that allows you to count. Sure. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pocket? Yeah, ja, a schlüssel. Your car keys. Duh, wait, ideas. Describe my keychain. A cute robot panda keychain. That's super max. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I? Um. Jetzt muss ich überlegen. Quarters sind 15 Cent, sind nicht sind 60 Cent. Das sind 86 Cent. A6. That's right. Large and Arctic Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. A parking ticket. You know well. But was the exact time I was busted? 10:34. Uhr. 10:34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Amazing balls. I literally got chills all over my neck. You have 
have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I am freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict future. No way! Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. So, ähm, alles klar, ich muss erst an dieser Stelle die Folge beenden, weil sonst wird das zu lange. Ähm, sorry, dass ich so lange jetzt überzogen habe, die 10 Minuten. Aber wir sehen uns dann gleich in der nächsten Folge wieder. Schaltet wieder ein, es wird sehr interessant. Bis gleich.